From First Class Services, you are at day two of your 10 day challenge. Woo! I'm so excited for you guys because I have so much validation to share with you from today, okay? So just let me get out of my intersection. Anyway, um, okay, so I was just doing my normal service delivery and I went back to my client. You know how it is when you're a senior and you're running four people on the floor at once. That's how you do it. Anyway, I go back to do my haircut after this color consultation and she said, oh, Trish, I just love the way that you look after your clients. It's exceptional. It's exceptional. And I was like, oh, thank you. And then we have had... Cameron Hunter from Tony and Guy in Auckland. He doesn't work at Tony and Guy anymore, but he's Tony and Guy trained and he's epic. And so he comes in and does one on one training with my apprentices, and it's well worth the investment. And um, we're out the back, and I said, Oh, Tony, uh, sorry, Cameron, I'm heading out now, but before I go, have you got any feedback you'd like me to take on board for the way I'm leading my team and what you see? Blah, blah, blah. And he's like, No. Oh my god, I was so excited to come back here because he's been once before and he said, I said to my partner Rob, I said, he said, are you going to that really cool salon? And he's like, yeah, yeah. And he goes, you know, everything, the way you guys treat your clients, it's like coming into someone's home. He said, the upselling, everything, the way you all jump in together and you look after your clients as a team. Now I'm sharing this with you because this is proof that when people people really see service they really see it and we are a very small salon we're not flash I'd love to do my salon up but you know there's other priorities and like you know it's just so great to hear that validation of why and how it looks that epic service and it means you can charge appropriately because your service stands out it means you can afford to get people like Cameron Hunter to come in and do one-on-one -on -one training with each of your apprentices. And you know what that means? That means you get CVs dropped off. You barely have to advertise. You go from not like not being able to find staff, maybe not being able to find motivated apprentices or you know maybe a poor calibre of apprentices to the best ones. So that's why I'm sharing that with you. The power of service, it does get noticed. Better service equals better invoices. Enjoy your last, the end of day two. Day three tomorrow, last part of the challenge.